everybody. It's Cindy from Chicken Minutes and today we are going to be taking care of a rooster's Barney Spurs. So we've got them ready to go. He's not too happy about it. But I'm sure they're hurting them they're quite big. Say hi, hi Barney. Barney. So we're going to cover him up so he doesn't get too excited and he doesn't get too scared. And also protect me and protect him to some degree. All right. Now, he's a real trickster. So here's the potato, baked potato we cooked until it's nice and warm. All right. Put that on there, Sin. Push there. it all the way on. It's all the way on. Okay, now we're just going to have to sit here and wait. This basically, uh, it doesn't hurt the rooster at all, but it's, it's making the, the uh, spur tender. And he's got some big old spurs. Nope, oh, the chickens are out. <laughs> so we'll sit it on there for a little bit. He's nice and calm. We'll do both of these, and then we are going to put some of the starch. You can use corn starch, or you can use blue coat. I was going to use blue coat, and the can blew up in my hand, and I got Thank stained you. all over the place, so I... <laughs> It's going to stay there for a while. This way, it helps if there was any bleeding. Yep, helps stop the blood a little bit. There's not much blood at all when they do this, just a very little bit. And it protects the hens and it makes it so it, it doesn't hurt. Yep, he's, um, he's putting a hurting on these hens. Their backs are bare in some places, you know. Just, he's stripping the feathers off of them with the... Uh, Is his head covered up, Sim? Because he's he keeps pulling back on me here. I should have gave him a little bit more towel. This thing's coming off. Okay. He's pulling. Okay, so the potato's off, and all we're going to do now is we're going to hopefully he don't move too much, and hopefully you see this on camera. Yeah, move up a little bit to, the, to towards me. There you go. Okay. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to gently twist it and look at that. Just like that. It comes right off and we're going to put a little cornstarch on that. Well, we're going to do the other one first. Nope, not yet because okay. I'll be wearing it, I'm sure. Now this spur is a little more difficult. It's a these are big spurs. I mean, look at the spur he's got here. Big old sucker. All right, Cindy, put that potato on there. And again, this just heats up the the spur, makes it a little bit easier for removal. You can do it without a potato, um, but I like to do it with the potato. It's much easier. They really just spin right off. And lately, we've been seeing Barney laying down a bit. Uh, not walking as much, so it could yep. be that the spurs were really bothering him also walking, so yep. it will help him also, besides the hens. It looks like he might, uh, this one here, looks like he might have a little bit of bumblefoot. He's got a blister over here on this foot. They can be uh, pretty bad. It looks like it's, a, it's bumblefoot, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. I just want to get this taken care of, and we'll... Uh, dust up his uh, other spur. This is going to grow back, this spur. Um, it'll take some time, but it'll grow back. I'm hoping you guys can see all this. Let me grab my pliers because I dropped them once that came off. Oh, wait a minute. Wish I could see. Okay. Here you go. You could see 
the spur and what the mm -hmm. inside looks like. It's just the one empty Yeah, it's just shell. hollow. It's just a shell, basically. Yeah. Kind of looks like pasta. Looks All like right. one of those toenails that you, or fingernails you put on for Halloween. <laughs> well, it's almost Halloween. You could use them as fangs. You go as uh, <laughs> Dracula or something, you know. All right, so I think we're good here. I'll get my pliers out. We're going to dust him. He's going to be done in a second. So hang in there, Barney. We're almost done. Oh, it's slipping. It's sliding real nice on there. You can feel it. Okay. Now well, let's take some, some dust here. And I'll just dab it on there with my hands. I'm not going to go do it any special way. <laughs> okay, Barney. There you go, buddy. All right. Quick and easy, and very pain, uh, painless for the for the rooster. Yeah, is. All right. So there we go. Here's Barney. He don't look so happy. Look at that. He don't look very happy. He wants to just be let go. Go see his girl. So we're gonna go put him back. He's gonna be happy in a minute. So. I have it. Okay. Ready? I'm gonna let Barney go. Okay, Barney. There you go, buddy. He feels like a new man. And look at him go, following those hens. He's, gonna go He's walking out. good. And you can hear him clucking away in there. Barney's going in, and we'll see how many of the hens go in, following him. Okay, come on, girls. Come on. Here you go, one more. Come on, girl. Come on, in you go. I'm going to close the door because it's too early to let them out. Uh, the fox might... Uh, the hawk will come by. The yeah. fox will come by and swoop down and snatch them up. Yay. And that is Chicken Minutes for you. See you next time.